Word on the street. Word on the street. Word on the street. <laughs> Good morning, Babs. How are you? Good morning. Is it cold outside? It's like, no, because the sun is not. And I want to introduce you. They're, they don't have tons of time. To Keith and Tay, we're on Norton Parkway. Maybe can you guys get close together? Yeah. All right, Keith and Tay. And I learned this morning that this is guy time, all right? The day's about <laughs> to start, and this is a regular ritual for Keith and Tay, which yeah. is that you need five minutes. Is it of guy time? How much time you need? Usually, like, like the 15 minutes. We spend 15 minutes together out the day. This is the 15, 20 minutes. And so what's the word on the street, guys? Just right. to live life and, you know, learn that, you know, there's a lot of good things out here instead of being mad at the world. Like, you need to just get out and have fun and reconnect with everything around you, including Mother, you know, Mother Nature. So I'm with you on that one. You know, I can even go on a street like this and I see that tree and that tree and I kind of feel like sometimes we don't notice it's right there. You know what I mean? We have this thing where we're, we were talking, we were promoting ambition. So we, our biggest thing is ambition and, and applying that in our actual lives and also sharing that with the people as well. So that's a big thing. And Babs, can you hear us pretty well, Babs? Yes, I can. Very well. So tell me about this ritual. So Keith lives here on Norton. And where do you live, Ty? Um, the truth or the lie? The truth. <laughs> you want the truth? Um, I actually uh, I stay in the back seat of my car. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. It's okay. But where, where does the back, where do you park overnight? I park overnight in like solitated areas. So like areas with a lot of trees and, you know, a lot of water and stuff like that. It's actually kind of comfortable. So uh -huh. because I have time to myself. And then do you have a job you go to during the day? Where do you go? I go to a agency right here. It's called Complete Labor Staffing on Early Avenue. So what time are you going to head over there? I go there at five o'clock in the morning every Monday through Friday. Mm -hmm. I had to go this morning. Did you get something for today? Yeah, of course. Where are you going to be? After today, after this, I'll probably go to the beach and uh, probably go watch some sports. All right. And then, Keith, where do you work? Uh, to be honest, I'm everywhere. I'm a chef. So it's like, wherever. You're what? I'm a chef. Oh, cool. So it's like, wherever they need me, I'm there. So, so who are they? Who do you work for? Anybody, like, I'm available. Like, uh -huh. I'll pretty much is like, I'll go to an agency or whatever. So where are you today? Where are you going today? To be honest, I don't know. I'm just waiting for a call right All now. All right, you're waiting for a call. So you're both waiting for a call today. Yeah. So but that's why I was about to go get dressed and everything. So if they just be like, just come to work at this location, I could just be at, I could just be somewhere that, you know, that just be like, yeah, we need somebody with extra hands that's good at working. So with who calls the chef? Like, what agency is it? Is a temp agency I go through. Is I think I just moved out there. I think it's in like Hamden or something. And where'd you move from? Florida. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. What brought you up here? A lot of stuff. Like you, you knew people here? Yeah, family. Oh, did you used to be here years yeah. ago? Okay, you grew, I grew up, here? up here. Yeah, this this is my hometown. It's now you can tell me about New Haven. Like I grew up here. I love New Haven. It's in my blood. So it's like. I'd rather come back and try to, you know, put other people back on the right way and, you know, stay positive and get off that good energy that we need in this world. When did you go down to Florida? How old were you? I was, damn, it's been a minute. Mm -hmm. were you, what were you hoping to find in Florida? Like, no, no, I just it? moved down there, like, you know, with family, and then I realized I had more family back home, and cool. I came back. So I was interested when you guys talk about guy talk. Right. Like, how did you meet up this morning? How did you know he was going to be here? Is it arranged so or is just lucky? This was actually just lucky. I was actually coming, this bitch was, I was actually coming to get some weed for my mm -hmm. friend because mm -hmm. I do smoke marijuana. I'm a marijuana user. You, you in about half the country. Right. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. Everyone, everyone. Uh, yeah, and uh, so my cousins that came outside, we started talking. I was like, hey, let's, let's have some dice. Let's, oh, he was helping you out. Yeah. Okay. Gotcha. Like, hey, let's have some dice. But had you called him first to get the weed, or was just accident? Like, no, how'd he you called me? Actually. Oh, he said he had some weed he for you. He called me. He said, "Yo, I got some pot for you." I was like, hey, "Okay." So then you came over. Here. So the, you, how much did you get? Probably like a couple of grams. A couple of grams. Okay. Yeah. And then what was the guy talk? Then he said, "Let's hang out and talk." The guy I'll talk. That was That's I'll see you later. All right. Later. Can I? Can I get one quick? All right. Can I knock on your door when we're done? I just want to ask you something when we're done. Yeah. Okay, what store are you on? I'm on 
I'm on the second floor. All right, cool. So, but yeah, so the guy talked was basically just about um, <laughs> it's funny, it's funny because we're young, of course. Yeah. We're gonna, we're gonna How old talk you? about women. I'm 23. Uh huh. We're gonna talk about women. We're gonna talk about sports. We're gonna talk about all that type of stuff and how that's going around and operating around our lives. And what we do is we just talk about what's bothering us. So what did you talk about this morning specifically? Do you remember? And did you get high first or did you wait? We got high first. We got, got high first, first. and in the car. First. We got high first. We got in the car. We went for a ride. We went to the boat ramp. In West oh, the boat ramp in West Haven. Nice. We went over there and uh, we were just talking about just creating businesses and trying to create more jobs for people the way people create jobs for other people and for us, you know? So why can't we expand on that? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And make it easier. We, I just, we were just trying to talk about how we can make it easier on our lives, mm -hmm. how we can make things easier for us. Is it sometimes not easy? It's not. I mean, you sleep in your car, it's not easy. It's not. That, it's, uh, Even though it's comfortable, crazy, yeah. you wish you weren't. Sleep. Could you be sleeping somewhere else? Too? Yeah, of course I could sleep somewhere else. So why you, why the car? I choose the car because it's more personal. Uh huh. It's, I can have space. Gotcha, man. I, I I am a person who's like undiagnosed with like anxiety and depression. Uh huh. I'm sorry. And I just like to be more to self. Got you. A lot of people, you know, we need our time alone, right? Right, right. So you went to the boat ramp. I don't know where that is in in West Haven. West Haven, West Haven, West Haven, Connecticut, over around the corner, probably about like five minutes from Kimberly. Oh, okay. So, so right near the border there. Right, right, right and how long did you guys hang out there? Like 10 minutes. And then you brought him back because he had to work? Yeah. And what happened when you went this morning at five o'clock? They didn't have anything for today? No, uh, not really. They didn't really have anything for today, so I just went about my day. But tomorrow, man, uh, I'm rooting for you. Babs, do you have any questions? There's a um, there's a, a job fair on the green today from two to two to two to six or seven. So if you're downtown, if you have time, the uh, the uh, Workforce Alliance is hosting a job fair downtown today. Comprehensive with food, music, uh, training programs, access to jobs. Real quick, so if you if you're around. Stop downtown on the green. It's on the green. Okay. We're not going to fall up an ass. She's just letting you know. Yeah, it's okay. And I actually do other things too. I've been doing other things for a while. I've been helping like content creators, like YouTube, upcoming YouTube content creators. So what do you content. do with them? So what I do is I do like visuals. I'll help with camera movement and like camera effects and stuff like that. I'm good with stuff like that and graphic design. Um, I've been doing that for a little minute, probably since I was like 15. Um, uh, I have a, it's a YouTuber I've been working with, his name is Jaquan Cooks, and he goes by the name on YouTube, it's called Quan Swish. Mm -hmm. um, so what do you do with Quan? What I do with Quan is we make funny, like funny reels. Mm -hmm. So we go in public and make funny reels with, with people like- I'd love to watch some of them. Well, it's another upcoming artist that's coming up right now. He's with Six Degrees Entertainment, and his name is Jew. What are you doing with him? He sings. And do you make a video for him? Like, you have a camera? It's, it's videos. All of them. We use regular phones. Okay. Sometimes we use regular phones, and then we'll transfer it to computer platforms, mm -hmm. and we'll work on it. Uh, a computer platform, and then we'll edit it, and then we'll post it and send it out. But not right away. We usually we'll do like previews and stuff like that on our music and stuff like that. So that's also a good thing. And then, um, so what I'm going to do is when we're off the air, I'm going to ask you for those links so we can put in the New Haven Independent, let people see those videos you've been doing. Um, I believe if you go on YouTube, you can go to Six Degrees TV uh -huh. and Jews, that'll be Jewish channel. Uh -huh. And then for Jaquan, you can go and at him at Quan Swish. Mm -hmm. All right, Babs, any more questions here? No, be safe out there. Thank you, thank you. Thank All right, so well, much. thanks for joining. You know, I really appreciate you I being open. You We're going to get a photo. Happy. We're going to put the videos up on the independent. And this is from Norton Parkway. We're saying back to Love Babs, Love Talk, and WNHHFM New Haven's home.
Thank you for all. community radio. I tell you, 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 we hear some incredible stories and we meet some incredible people um, out here while we do, uh, when we do word on the street, it's, we meet some incredible people, some incredible people.